In this video, we're going to be looking at the topic of profit in economics. And this is video one of three videos on profit that I'm going to do. So first of all, profit is defined as revenue minus cost. So in my previous videos, I've talked about revenues and costs. So if you haven't watched those, please go back to those. And when you do revenue minus cost, we end up with profit. So an easy way to understand this is like, for example, for your yourself, you know, income minus your expenditure is your profit left uh, for the month as a, as a person who's working. Okay, so a similar thing for a business. Okay, so don't forget profit is the measure of a firm's economic welfare. Okay, and we assume like rational, uh, rational firms, rational consumers, rational everyone want to maximize their welfare. So we're, assume, we're assuming in traditional economic theory that firms want to maximize profits. Okay. So profit is also the risk, okay, uh, reward function, okay? So basically, when entrepreneurs take risks, profit is the reward uh, for that, okay? The higher the risk, the higher the profit needs to be. The lower the risk, the lower the profit is generally going to be. Okay, so next thing is normal profits versus supernormal profits. What's the difference between these two things? Well, normal profit, okay, this is the minimum amount of profit that a firm needs to survive. Where a supernormal profit is above minimum. Okay, so if essentially the firm is being over rewarded for the factors of production that they're using in the production process, okay? So in economics, normal profit is considered the level where the firm breaks even, okay? So at the point where revenue equals the cost, okay? So this is slightly different. So economists, right? Economists take into account opportunity costs within the cost model, unlike accountants. So earlier on, we said that profit equals revenue minus cost. So if revenue equals cost, then profit would be zero. So that might confuse some of you. But don't forget that economists take into account opportunity costs within costs. If that didn't make sense, then please watch the videos back about uh, costs in my uh, previous videos. So in the next video, we're going to be looking at profit maximization. Okay, so if you want to find out about profit maximization and how that works, works just watch that one. Any questions, just uh, let me know in the comment section below.